Uh, once again, the Coachella Valley gave the president a huge welcome on his sixth trip here to the desert. People were lining the streets to catch a glimpse of the commander in chief. KMIR's Kitty Alvarado was also at the airport covering the arrival. She joins us now live to talk about the crowds and excitement. Kitty. It was so exciting to be there and watch Air Force One land. And if you take a look behind me, crowds are still streaming here just to get a picture with the famous, the one and only Air Force One. And you know what? It was such an exciting time, especially for a group of students from Palm Springs High School who came to see the huge plane descend in the desert, carrying the leader of the free world. Among the crowds gathered around Palm Springs International Airport to watch Air Force One land with President Obama was a group from Palm Springs High School. This future serviceman waited patiently, ready to salute the Commander in Chief. After high school, I'm, I'm going to be going into the service, and, and it's to meet the Commander of the Forces is unbelievable. Their government teacher says it's an opportunity for his students to be a part of history. As an American government teacher, having the president come nine blocks from the school, uh, the students absolutely, uh, you know, need to be here and want to be here. This may be President Obama's sixth trip to the desert, but these students don't take it for granted. Very excited. Um, I've seen her a couple times um, when he came down before. It's an honor, honestly, like having the president just come to our city. Students from Palm Springs High School and the president have a special bond. Our band marched in the inaugural parade and they uh, let our students see the presidential limousines the last time right after he left it was just a terrific and wonderful experience. This visit ended up being pretty special for that ROTC commander from Palm Springs High School. The president came on by in the second SUV. As I was saluted, I noticed he was in the car and he was, he recognized my salute and waved on by as he was passing. And how did that feel? It was, it was amazing to see the president up front and not in a book or, or on TV in person. It was fantastic. It was unbelievable.